Kansas City School Superintendent wants parents to know their kids are returning to a safe place. This after a report of a sexual assault at Southwest Early College campus last week. Shannon Halligan spoke with Dr. Green today about what steps the district is taking to protect students. This is the letter that was sent home with students this afternoon. In it, it says that the girl is receiving counseling, but some parents wonder why it took five days for notification. Starting today, administrators at Kansas City Public Schools will make sure all school cameras are working and security procedures are correct. All this after a 17-year-old girl says she was raped at Southwest Early Education College campus. In this police report, she says two boys, 14 and 15 years old, carried her into a small room that was full of desks and is usually locked and secured. She kept telling them, let me go. I was just shocked. I was just shocked and I just hoped it wasn't true, you know. I thought maybe it was just a rumor or something. I just hoped for the best that it wasn't true. The rape was reported on Thursday. The district sent a letter home to parents today. Superintendent Dr. Stephen Green said they waited to gather all of the facts. Well, it happened on a Thursday, and then we were trying to uh, keep, catch up to the investigation, and so we didn't want to get ahead of the, the, the law enforcement process. We also know that we're dealing with minors. Uh, confidentiality is, is key. Dr. Green says the boys pried open a classroom that is normally locked. He says the district is already taking steps to prevent future incidents. We're reviewing all of our safety and proto safety procedures. We have a, a commission on, on uh, school safety. Uh, obviously, this will be high on that agenda there. We've uh, done a walkthrough of the building and looking for any kinds of other uh, types of uh, vulnerable areas and making sure we shore those up. The two boys remain in custody at the Jackson County Juvenile Detention Center. And on 41 Action News at 6, hear what parents think about the superintendent's plan to keep their kids safe. Live in Kansas City, Shannon Halligan, 41 Action News.